Emily and I here and welcome to episode number 6 of our Pokemon Ruby Retirement Lock series. Uh, today we are, well in the last episode we made it to Duford Town. We got a couple of encounters uh, in Duford, in and around Duford area. Uh, today we are going to be training for the gym because we are really low level. Really low level. Uh, I'm not sure, I'm not sure we could take on this gym <laughs> just yet. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do a quick team recap. Uh, we're also gonna get an encounter in Granite Cave today. Uh, so we've got Swift the Tailo, level nine with Pep Growl, Focus Energy, and Quick Attack. We've got Ralph the Poochiena, level nine with Tackle Howl and Sand Attack. Rocket the Zigzagoon, level nine with Tackle Headbutt, Tail Whip, and Cut. Rage the Shroomish, level eleven with Absorb, Tackle, Stun Spore, and Leech Seed. Sarge in the Mud Kip, level 12 with Water Gun Tackle, Mud Slap, and Rock Tomb. And Fernando the Sea Dot with uh, level 13 with Bide, Nature Power, Bully Seed, and Growth. We're not ready for the uh, for the gym yet. We are definitely not ready for the gym. We've got this dude up here that we need to, uh, to battle. He can't go to the washroom. He can't go to the toilet. Just can't. In case he hooks a big one, he cannot go. First world problems, I suppose. That's Peck. How much are we going to do? He does five. Uh, he's got Constrict as well, okay. That does nothing. But he does outspeed. So we're going we're gonna to swap to Quick Attack. Hmm, nearly. We need to get Swift leveled up. That's the... That's sort of the... Uh, the main thing that we need to do here. Well, there's this a good way of doing it. Getting two levels from that. All right, my dude. Which do you prefer, fishing in the sea or a stream? To be honest, I don't fish. I'm not. I'm not a fisher. I've never, I've never actually been fishing. But I imagine it's something that I would find quite boring. Just kind of sitting there waiting for something to happen. I suppose I could take my DS with me. If I could take my DS out with me. Uh, yeah, I suppose I'd be alright then. Or a book, I suppose. Okay, another tentacle. This one's a lot lower level though, so we're okay. Oh, the one shot with the crit. That was nice, Swift. That was nice. Level 12. This is better. He learns wing attack really early, doesn't he, Taylor? These magic cards are so high defense. Yeah, I'm not sure if we're going to be taking on the gym this episode. Um, mainly because we are so underleveled. Uh, what level can we go to? We can get to 14. Any higher than 14, and we've got to we've got to stop. So we're gonna oh, we'll get the granite granite cave encounter. In fact, we might as well do granite cave, and then we'll go and train on the beach in Slateport. Hi, dude. Hey, it's you. Hey, hey, you! It gets awfully dark ahead. It'll be tough trying to explore. The guy who came by earlier, Steven, I think it was, he knew how to use Flash, so he ought to be alright, but... Well, for us hackers, helping out those we meet is our motto. Here you go, I'll pass this on to you. Okay, HM5. We're not teaching anybody Flash. I'm telling you right now, we are not teaching anybody Flash. Our first encounter in Granite Cave is... a Makuita. A Makuita, that's nice. I like that. We're going to quick attack. I was about to say, hold back, Swift. Don't, uh, Don't go critting or anything. Mm. Speaking of critting. That's great ball. Okay. 
So, uh, if you guys watch my Pokemon Prism Nuzlocke, um, we did have a Makuita on there. Makuita is tenacious. It will keep getting up and attacking its foe, however many times it's knocked down. Every time it gets back up, this Pokemon stores more energy in its body for evolving. Uh, yeah, I don't know if, if you saw it, then... Then you'll, uh, you'll know this name. But we got Nia Jax. Nia Jax, who is not like most girls. If you guys don't know Nia Jax, she's a, she's a wrestler in WWE at the moment. Um, and one thing about Nia Jax is she's a, she's a big lady. She's a big lady, especially in comparison to all of the other wrestlers. And do you think we could take this on? We should be able to. Okay, we do over half, so that's good. Okay, Pokeball. Pokeball's nice. We do actually need more Pokeballs. We're, we're running out. We'll have to get some at Slateport. See, I wouldn't have minded an Aaron either. Aaron's a pretty good Pokemon. I wouldn't have minded that. We can we got an item on Rocket. Yeah, I, I wouldn't have turned down getting an Aaron. Kind of can't turn down getting anybody, to be fair, but. Aaron would be pretty good. Just because he's defensive. Real defensive. Okay. So, there's stairs around here somewhere. Then it's across. I did memorize Granite Cave when I was younger to, so that I didn't need Flash. My memory's uh, hopefully paying off for me. Come on, break through, Swift. Break through. Okay, as long as he's not got wing attack. There we go. Level 13 for Swift. And he's about to learn wing attack. Excellent. That's what we needed. Uh, we'll get rid of focus energy. Never use focus energy. Never use focus energy. Uh, let's take this item off Rocky. Let's see what we got. We got another rare candy. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Um. Let's uh, let's swap Swift out from the front. I know we need to train Swift, but he's getting a higher level now. We need to also train Rocket and Ralph. Otherwise, we can't use Pokemon. And I don't want to be training them against the the Pokemon on the beach. Pokemon on the beach could be a little bit tougher. Pretty sure there's an item up on here. Everstone. There's no no actual item item. Do nothing. And we just hear ourselves in confusion all the time. Let's uh, swap, swap out. Um, we will swap into Sarge, yeah. We need this um, this training. 38 experience, that's it. Man. We're just going to have to do some sort of grinding montage with... Uh, with Rocket and Ralph at some point. We're not staying in against the Makuita. Despite the fact that it is a lot lower leveled, we're not staying in against the Makuita. Well, 
Not sure if he's even got arm thrust. Maybe we could have stayed in. Okay. Again, we're going to rage. Yeah, sorry for the speed up. Just most of these wild encounters, you don't really want to be seeing them. Ah, oh, that device you have there, it's a Pokenav. When trainers that have Pokenavs battle, it keeps a re record of how things went, I think. Oh, pardon me, my name is Steven. I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Oh, a letter for me. Okay, thank you. You went through all this trouble to deliver that. I need to thank you. Let me see, I'll give you this TM. It contains my favourite move, Steel Wing. Not sure why it's his favourite move. Your Pokemon appear quite capable. If you keep training, you could even become champion of the Pokemon League one day. That's what I think. Now I've got to hurry along. Hint, hint. Hint, hint. Keep going. And you'll get to battle me. So let's teach Steel Wing to Swift. So that he can deal with rock types. Not that I'm really going to stay in against rock types, but you know. Still. The one thing that I can't do is, like, be conservative with what I'm learning and things like that. I, I can't I can't keep thinking, well, I might, uh, I might have to retire this Pokemon at the end of the next gym, so I can't teach him any moves. No, I need, I need to teach him moves. I need to teach moves to Pokemon. Yeah, let's go with the... with Rage. But this one actually does have Arm Thrust. There we go. That was good experience, actually. Good experience for Rocket. Yeah, Go away! We do need the training, so actually I can't I can't say go away. So we're gonna head over to the beach now, I guess. We've got Steel Wing. Well we let's get the silk scarf. It's a good good idea as well. Good your eyes on this, it's a silk scarf! Oh, that didn't did <laughs> totally just skip through that before I could read it. We've got a silk scarf. Got a silk scarf. We could put that on six again, but at the same time, we'd be um, sacrificing pickups. And pickup, we've been getting a couple of like rare candies and stuff from pickup. So don't really want to be doing that. Don't really want to sacrifice pickup. Ah, uh, no, go away. Right, let's head over to the beach. We've got another encounter over there. So, if we remember rightly, it was 107. So, is the beach still 107? Because we got an encounter in Route 107. No, there's 108. 109. Okay, so the beach is 109. We're not actually in Slateport yet. Let's just check. How in that? Yeah, Route 109. So let's try see what we can fish up here. But I'm willing to bet that I'm fishing up Magikarps and Tentacruels. Tentacruels. In which case, I'll leave this until later. Okay, I can't be bothered. I'll look it up online. I will look it up. In fact, let's do that now. Let's do that now so that we can see. Uh, route 109. Uh, Sarah B. Okay, this matchup is scary. Let's see, uh, let's swap into Swift. Route 109. 
the stuff is a lot. Hmm. Okay, uh, Route 109. That's ORAS. Yeah, it's ORAS. I don't want ORAS. I just want. Um, Yeah, this is it, this is it. Old Rod, Magikarp and Tentacle. Yeah, it's not, you, you can't get anything else until you get the good Rod. Or the good Rod or Surf. Okay, so his matchup was, uh, was scary strong. Ooh, Soft Sand. Soft Sand is useful. Actually, we are going to be getting a ground type soon. Doesn't a beach umbrella look like a giant flower? Looks like an umbrella. Be honest. I will be honest. It looks like an umbrella. See, we're even under leveled here compared to these Azurils and stuff. But Azurils should only have bubble. So these tail whips don't matter. Zigzagoons takes a lot of training. Like, in comparison to to Taylor that was taking next to no training at all to get leveled up, Zigzagoon just takes ages. Oh, don't charm. There we go, level 11 for, for Rocket. Now we need to make sure that we've got because getting up to level 11 allows us to get to 17 with uh, 16 with Taylor, so we need to make sure Ralph's up there as well. I think this keeping the team perfectly leveled is probably the worst rule in this uh, in this lock, and it probably makes for a little bit of a boring playthrough. To I don't know, it's not boring playthrough, but. It, it distracts from the playthrough a little bit, but at the same time, you don't want... I don't want to have, like, one team member running through. Running through the game. This guy's got Surf on his Zigzagoon! Mmm, that did a lot. Um, we're going to go into Fernanda. So we could have eaten the surf. Hang on, nature power in the sand. Isn't that earthquake? Could have used, could have, could have got an earthquake off on this zigzagoon. Pretty sure it's earthquake. Mm. Earthquake. Boom. Okay, level thirteen for Sahajian. Doesn't um, Fernando evolve at level fourteen? Have I got that right? I'm pretty sure he's really early evolving C dot. And then it's a leaf stone to get Shiftry. But I'm pretty sure it's level 14 that he evolves. It's no good no good for this gem. Kinda prefer not to evolve him before the gem. But Let's head in here. 
We're gonna have a chat with these guys. We get, can get some soda pops. I'm gonna show you how great my Pokemon are, but don't cry. I won't cry. I won't cry. Sniffle a bit, perhaps, but. He's got a zero rails. We actually do nothing to this zero. All them turns and the amount of times he's used splash. Okay, we can't stay in on an actual Marrow. We just can't stay in on an actual Marrow. <laughs> Especially because we were probably at minus six defense then. I knew that we couldn't. I knew that we uh, we weren't losing against the uh, the Azuril. But we were definitely at minus six attack. We were probably at minus six defense as well. So. And this Marrow's got defense kill. We were definitely not staying in. Hmm. Absorb's nice. Absorb here. Uh, healing me up nicely. I think there's a gold Ean in here, isn't there? I might be completely wrong with that assessment. I feel like there's a Goldeen in here. Is Goldeen actually in this game? Oh, I don't know. See, he won't cry either. He's strong. Boring battles aren't worth the effort. Fiery hot battles are what toughen up trainers and Pokemon. Okay. Do you say so, love? Kind of uh, want to check Slateport as well. There is a Goldeen in here. My uh, my memory is coming back to me. <sighs> I just don't think Ralph can cut it. Right, let's check Slateport. Uh, see, Old Rod can only fish up Magikarps and Tentacles wherever they go by the look of it. Heck, does a lot. And we don't heal enough. So we can't get another encounter in Slateport. Well, we could, but... Um, there's no... There's no need just yet. I'd rather get a, a good encounter later than get a, a rubbish encounter now. Especially, you, you, we don't want to end up with two Magikarps on the team. We just don't want that. That'll not be a fun time. It's a lot of experience. Ralph still doesn't level up. Okay, the last dude in here. If you're looking for a battle on the Hass Eagle fan, no harder trainer than me, matey. So our last battle in here, then we'll pick up our soda pops, we'll head back to Doofit and end the episode off there. We might actually be able to take on this Wingle. How much damage does he do to me? Ten! You're a Wingle! Why do you do ten damage? We're never training up this Poochiani. <laughs> In between episodes, I am going to pop back and get the experience share. Yeah. So, that's one thing we can do. <sighs> My job. Matchup is pretty scary. It, is Talos okay? It's not scary at all. 
Sarge improving that I don't need to go into Swift just to uh, take on a matchup. That's some good experience. And a tentacle. Yeah, I can stay in a mud slap, can't I? <laughs> Sarge in Savage! Savage! It's not that serious, man. Those battles blazed. I'm more than just satisfied. As a thanks for showing me your hot streak, I want you to take these. It's half a dozen battles of soda pop. I'll take it. I'll take it. I appreciate it. Uh, did we battle? We haven't battled this guy, have we? I don't think we did. Nope, we didn't. We might as well battle everybody. This will definitely be our last battle. Uh, we can't take on these Wingles. They do too much damage to me. We're still within level, though. We, we, we're not over-leveled with Sahaj yet at the moment, so... But I do need Ralph to, to level up. See you later. You ain't living. Sergeant with another crit. Just taking lives. Asking no names. Just match up again. But we are confused this time. So I am going to swap out into Swift. So this guy got basically the same team as uh, the guy in the house. Okay, just point out that Swift does not kill matchup that's a level below him. And we are going to be facing harder matchups than that. Yeah, let's wing attack. Yeah, we are going to be facing harder matchups than that, which. Uh, is a little bit scary. Okay. Let's say about to do for Fium. Alright then. We're going to heal up in the Pokemon Center and uh, end this episode off here. Uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed this episode of Pokemon Ruby Retirement Lot. Please leave a like down below. Subscribe to me. I post Pokemon content daily. And I will see you next time. Stay brave, guys.